Hey guys, sorry for the delay. I got confused on how to get a Facebook live video. So welcome to our Rancho Santa Fe estate sale. Um, it is, we're doing this by appointment. If there's something that you're interested in and want to purchase, you can either DM me here and I will, after the sale, send you an invoice. Um, and so the item, I will tell you what it is, um, the price with tax. Um, and if you want to use Venmo or Zelle, there's no fee. If you want to do PayPal, there's a 2.9%. And, uh, if you want to use a credit card, there's a 3.4%. So anyway, and then you pick up tomorrow through Sunday. So um, basically, we're going to start. Um, if you're interested, uh, again, you can either email me at 85, I mean, not email, please don't email me. <laughs> you could DM me here or you can um, send me a text at 858 three 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 one eight five three so I'm gonna spin it around and we're gonna start okay so here we are at this really great Lillian Rice house in Rancho Santa Fe it's hard to see a little bit because of the car um, and we're gonna walk in um, I'm gonna start you off in the um, in the backyard where all the patio furniture is. And it is a lot of um, pieces by Salterini, a lot of pieces by Woodard. Um, I left it in the car because people will steal it. Oh, I know, I'm just, oh. yeah, I'll put it back in when I'm done. Oh, okay, oh great, um, sorry. <laughs> that was just a little side note that you guys didn't necessarily have to hear. But um, you know what, we're gonna start here in the guest house. First of all, we've got this great bowl sculpture. It's broken and it's $20. And then we have this side chair, it's $100. It's cute. This rug right here, it's small. It's probably a three by five. It is $50. And it's actually a little bit dirty. So with the cleaning, it'll look a whole lot better. This lamp, $40. This side table, it says 100, but I'll do it for 50 because of the condition. This is a sofa bed. It's really comfortable, really well made for $600. We've got this mirror for 50. We've got this, it's a three piece unit and it has a base and a top, although you can't see the base and the top right now. It measures to 122 inches and it goes with these other two pieces. So there's like a cap piece and a base piece. Um, and it is $1,800 for the three pieces, the cap and the base. Um, there's this rug right here. It's wool, it's from the 1940s. It's $300, the color is fantastic. This charming little rocking chair right here, $80. Very cute, intact wicker, um, which is great. Um, we've got this very sad clown painting. I think he's either eating a, I don't know why he's holding a cigar on a toothpick, but there you go, $150. It's by G. Pishner, 1965. This brass lamp for $20. This little dresser, solid wood for 50. This very nice chair for 50. It has condition issues. The wood is exquisite and you'll find at this sale, there's a lot of condition issues. There's this really charming painting of a blue bird. It's an oil, has a little hole in it for 500. Gorgeous floral. And then it's sort of a companion piece right here. So these two go together. They're very, very sweet. $500 a piece. They're both oils. They're not signed. We've got this great piece right here. Very, very charming. It looks like, I'm not sure which saint it is that's, a, that's connected to the moon but there are these angels, it's 17th century Italian, it's $250. Um, we have these prints right here, Hunter Jumpers by Claude LaRue, they're $100 a piece. We've got this great Vicini uh, refrigerator. It's like 24 inches wide, it's an apartment style. You know, if you have a small place, a guest house, something like that, it's perfect and it works. We've got these two spelter, um, these two spelter soldiers, they're kind of like Renaissance era. Um, they're 300 a piece. There's this very charming, like 1970s Renaissance revival jewelry box for 20. There's this very beautiful, it, this is a partner's desk. So we've got, um, 
it's it's got this great engraving on both sides it definitely needs to be refinished if you look at the top it's fifteen hundred dollars it is english renaissance uh, revival meaning it was made in the 1800s not the 15 or 1600s um, and this giant gentlemanly portrait of a man in a suit of armor it has a little paint spot there it was done by an artist by the name of Marini uh, Filippo, and um, I believe it is not old. Um, it is $500. Um, so then, let's see, I think we've seen, oh, we have some, you know, a Sony uh, Hi-Fi stereo for $35, another Sony DVD player for $35. We have this great Chinese Qing Dynasty um, horse, really gorgeous, hardwood, beautiful carving. The only issue is one of his ears has been damaged a little bit, but it's a really beautiful piece and it's $120. We have a lot of, um, this was a family that owned a lot of racehorses. This is a family, like an old San Diego family. Um, and anyway, so this, this picture right here of this racehorse, number two, is $75. And this dresser, with that, this mirror goes in between on the sort of uh, Lear si style, liar style. But this is sort of a mission style dresser. And it is uh, $250. So into the bathroom, we've got this really nice... Uh, shower curtain for ten dollars it's got like a terry cloth look here we've got this cute little eighty dollar eighties it looks like k eiley carousel horse very eighties colors really kind of good good for right now i think um because i think that look is coming back but i might be wrong but i think so um and then we've got these two mahogany headboards twin size a hundred dollars a piece this rug for 20 it is a little bit dirty. We've got these Japanese tempera paintings. This one right here is 70 and the price is based on condition issues, but it does have some thing right there. And then we've got this uh, standing lamp for 75. This bed has been purchased, so that is not available. Um, and but the mattress is still available. I think we have a, a double mattress and a queen box spring um, in this room. So um, now we're heading out. Somebody will be with you guys in just a minute. Okay, and then we'll head into the garage. So we've got a barbecue here for 35, a Weber barbecue. Sort of a little broken table for five and some blackout shades for 25 each and then a $30 balance. We have a Christmas tree for 50. Now in here there is okay so in here this is a marble top black lacquer cabinet French style $1,200 beautiful really really elegant. Um, we've got some Christmas decorations this topiary is 25 this big snowman is 35. This music box is 100. Those ornaments are 25. That Santa is 25. The bigger Santa is 35. The guitar playing reindeer is 25. And then the other topiary is 25. So we've got this fantastic settle. I, this is, um, this settle is on hold right now for $1,500. So I don't think it will be available. Um, this is the base for those pieces that we were looking at in the guest house. We also have, I'm going to kind of move this out of the way. We also have this really, really great Italian Renaissance Revival chest. And it is $1,500. It's really, I mean, look at the, the carvings are just fantastic. So this was done in the 1800s. That is a very muscular gent right there baby i don't know we have two mahogany solid mahogany very oversized doors for 500 a piece 
we have this gorgeous table. It has some condition issues, but, and it's $500 because of it, but it, I think we have all the pieces and um, it can be re recreated, but it just will require some work. Um, we have some sort of like, I'm gonna kind of just, you know, give you an overview of the like garage type of stuff um, because you can just come on Thursday or Friday or Saturday if you want that. These two stools are 100 each. Um, the suitcases are 25 each. The child's shelf with tools and toys um, is the shelf itself is 35 and some of the games are like 25 or different prices. We have a great ski bag here by Dan Danco for, or Dekine, I'm sorry, Dekine, and that I think is 35. The suitcase is 25. Um, ping pong table by Keller is 350. Have a lot of picture, like horseback racing pictures. Um, we have some scrapbooking stuff and some baskets. And then back here we have a painting by George Latour, or Roger Tours for 200. This sort of sexy velvet painting for 75. This uh, Jerry painting, and it's of um, a Native Dynasty by Jenny Quayle. And then this, that is $20. It's uh, So we've got this like very, um, it's $20 because it needs to be reupholstered. And it is a California King or a King size headboard for 50. There's also a wooden headboard and footboard for 100. And okay, so there is, there are, we are doing appointment only sales. Um, so I'm going to head in now over to the We'll head in here. So we've got this really great plastic nativity from, um, and it's $300. We have the wise men, we have the king, or the, the wise man, Mary, Joseph, baby Jesus, some animals, a shepherd boy. So that's $300 for that set. Um, we have a lot of Halloween. We have over here, we have a plaster, a nativity for 80 and then so a lot of these side tables now we're moving into the woodard furniture is 150 the two chairs are 400 each of these we have two the the coffee table no it's for sale it's 300 this set is 300 yeah uh so 75 for each of these you need to make a cushion 150 for this side table. This is a shelving unit for $100. Each ottoman is $100. The lounges are $500. The umbrella, which is down now, is $200. This side table is $150. So this lounge, this chair, this, uh, Sofa is 600, side table 100, coffee table 200, coffee table 200. The um, tricycle is sold. This bar cart is 600, it's very large. This table, it's woodard, it's 1200. Yep. And then we have a barbecue some little tables, little wire tables that are $50 a piece, and this, some plants for 25. Um, then we have a, a really fancy gun case. And, uh, as you can see right there. And then we have, so this is a lamp from the, this house was built by um, Lily and Rice back in the 20s. It's one of the, it's the oldest, most intact Rancho Santa Fe house of Lillian Rice. And so we have some of the pieces that were originally on the house. So this lantern is 150. This sconce is 150. Um, this hanging lamp is 150. This pair of Kerry Dids uh, 
drapery pulls are 400 for the pair. That decorative acorn is 25. This chair, and there is condition issues, is 50. The doorbell, I mean the two um, door pulls, door knobs, I guess. Let's see, how much did I price that at? $80. And then we have some more. We have a giant tapestry here, which has, again, some condition issues. Um, and this giant tapestry is, I believe the price is $100 because again, like there is a couple of holes. I think some vermin got into it a bit, but it is possible to repair. Um, over here we have St. Finacre, fin Finacre, Finacre, he's the, guard the patron saint of gardeners. And actually he was kind of a misogynist, so I'm not totally in support of him, although raised Catholic one does love the saints, but he was like a little, a little hard on the ladies. So just, you know, just keep that in mind. He's 50. Um, he looks so good though. He looks like he would be very loving, but he was not nice to the ladies. And I can't remember why, but I do know that. So anyway, so there's this charming little wire table for 70. We've got this great teak bench for 200. It's uh, 60 inches long. That little side table for 50. Um, now we can head into the house. And so there is a sale going on like by appointment. So if something is missing and you're looking for it, you better buy it now. So I, I mean, if you're, you know, if you definitely want something, cause I can't be sure. Um, let's see here. So this is not, you better buy it. Oh my God. Listen to me. But this is a king size bed frame. It's really incredible. We have this. Um, wire rack, $100, and then everything that's on it, you know, it's just, you know, a couple dollars here. Uh, we have this magazine rack, uh, and it is $25, and we have that hanging rack with birds, that's $25. This rusty pot, or urn, actually, that's a really nice urn, is $20. Um, we have tons of tools, but I'm not going to go through that stuff. You'll have to come here this cute little hand-painted trash can for 50, this beautiful vase for 25. Again, we have lots of things. We have a lot of tools. We have a weed whackers and blowers and rakes, a lot of gardening supply stuff, um, but I'll get to that last. We have a lot of fly fishing rods um, and pool sticks, pool cues. Here are the fly fishing rods. Hello, sir. Hey there. <laughs> and then, um, and then in here we have a lot of glasses. They're about two dollars a piece. And then we have a lot of pots and pans, a paella maker, a lot of like looks like calphalon or, uh, you know, really nice makers. You know, coffee pot, uh, a Cuisinart coffee pot maker, a. Cuisinart kettle, you know, just different, different things. Two pieces of this is fun for a, for a party, $40 for the Mexican stuff. We've got just kind of like a, so if there's anything that you want, hey, Laura, <laughs> it's nice to see you there watching. Um, yeah, and so we, okay, so this table is $700, it's, I believe, Carrera marble on top, 700. The chairs are 100 each. There's six of them. They've got that rustic farmhouse look. Um, so into here is the maid's room. We've got this dresser with a mirror, and this is, I believe, $250. This really cute dresser and mirror. We've got a twin bed and the, the twin bed sheets and comforter, and that is $100. The, the bedding is separate. Um, we've got this mid-century record uh, holder out of wood. That's $125, and the items that are on it. And we've got in here all these glasses are for sale. And they range, most of the glasses are about $2 a piece. 
Um, some of them are more, like these guys are $5 a piece and there's 10 of them. Someone was asking me about that earlier. Um, okay. And then we have an ironing board for 10, 15, a stool for eight. Uh, these little shelves are 50 each. Um, we have a lot of sort of, you know, vintage style entertaining things like a stainless steel fondue set. A lot of, um, you know, first aid equipment, that kind of thing. And that's, you know, the our usual prices are like, if it's opened, it's a dollar. If it's uh, closed, it's three dollars. But, you know, we sort of, you know, we base it on um, really, uh, you know, what it is. Because, you know, there's just really 10,000 objects and too many for us to, um, to price at one time. Um, now this is right here. We have a lot of different wrapping paper. If it's sealed, it's a dollar. If it's opened, it's 50 cents. And into this room right here. So we just have some towels, really cute towels actually. That's all we've got in here. And then a little uh, striped shower curtain for 10. And then we've got, you know, glasses and a soda stream for 10. Um, and then, you know, there's, you know, a trash can. I think we're selling that for 20, um, a lot of fun aprons. Look at how cute these are. Some of them are 10, like this is 10 and some of them are five, you know, or a dollar, you know, most are five. Um, but some of, or, oh, actually that was 15. I didn't realize that. Okay. So now, now we're moving into like the higher end area. Um, this chair, which is really fantastic, it's Renaissance Revival, made in the 1800s, but this one has some condition issues and it tends to, it's pieced together, so it needs a lot of love. It's $100. It's a corner chair, so if that's what you see. This is part of a lute, I mean of a, um, actually, I don't know what this instrument is called, but um, it's only part of it, and it is original but it has a lot of um, condition issues. So call me if you like that. So now this piece right here is really something else. It's um, Renaissance Revival Italian. It is has these amazing carved faces. I mean, the whole piece is just like incredible. Like if you have a home and you can hold this piece, it's just, you know, it's magnificent. It's really, really fine. Um, it is, I'll open it up so you can see what's inside, um, how it's made. It's $5,000. It's 135 inches wide from side to side. Um, on top, we have these two Art Deco lamps. There's two of them, and look at how delicate those little arms are. I love this lamp. I just think it's so great. It needs, you know, if you, I kind of like the way that it looks right now, but it, it's just really good, although it ha there are some condition issues here too. So these are 150 each. Um, this is a pewter sculpture for 50 of some, um, it's by Wallace. Um, gravy boat for 25, a lot of silver plate, two big hurricane lamps or vases, however you wanna use them for 40 each. This is an important piece right back here. This is by Mark Martinson, and it's called Apache Renegades. It's large, it's about 40 by 30, the piece itself. Um, or yeah, it's 40 by 60. Oh wow, I guess that's including the frame. Yeah, Apache Renegades, and um, it's $12,000, but it's a great piece. I mean, it's look at that, the color is just really, really good. I also love these two Irish wolfhounds. They are made in Germany. They're silver plate. Uh, one is 400 because his his leg has come off and it, that needs to be repaired. But the other one, his, he, uh, his leg has bent, but they're really, really beautiful and they're very, very striking. And would look, I mean, I would love those. I, those dogs would look really good in my house. Hmm, might have to think about that. So we've got this. I love these lamps. I just think they're so elegant. And they, they're so organic too, because they almost feel like octopus um, tentacles, you know? I mean, it's just really organic and fabulous looking. Um, it needs a little bit of love and it needs a lampshade, but, um, but there you go. So we've got two of these uh, Lowenbrow, you know, Munich 
1950s, 1960s steins. We have two, um, these are the lithophane uh, steins right here um, with one has a um, cannon on it and a dragon. It's $150 and you can see the lithophane insert, or not insert, but the lithophane on the inside. Um, and how you tell if it's, it's a fake one is if, um, if it is like, because sometimes they would put like naughty scenes on the inside, but um, the old ones never had that. Um, so that's, a, that's sort of a giveaway. Th this sort of will show like a soldier with his sweetheart, you know, it's very sweet. And this one also is a lithophane. These are $150 a piece. I can't tell you what the lithophane is right now, but. So these uh, Lowenbrow Steins are also, or Spot Spottenbrow, Munchen, Munch, Munchen, Munchen, I wish I spoke German, $20. Um, in fact, if any of my German friends ever happen to watch this, I'm so sorry to hear Hildegard is in the hospital. But we've also got some brown towels, um, which are... Where am I put these? Oh, you can just set them in the bathroom. Oh, I think they go in the set out there somewhere. Oh, I don't know. I'm doing a video, like a live video here. I don't know. I don't know. We've got... We've got... <laughs> we've got... I know it just seems ridiculous, but that's what I'm doing here. So, um, so we've got 14 of these chairs. They're $200 a piece and $250 armchair right here. We've got this beautiful Burlwood table. This one, it has the, um, I mean, look at the organic nature of this. You can just tell it was handmade. I mean, that is so great, just the shape and the size of it. I mean, in the wood. This, this, uh, this is so beautiful, but it definitely needs work. Um, this, I'm going to say $200. We have a huge bolt of the fabric for the chairs. Um, I think that's $200. Um, this is um, Isabel of Spain, and this is a, an engraving. Uh, it ha has a slight burn on it. It is $100, and there's another one that is in perfect shape. Um, the, it, these were colored after, um, after the fact. Um, but anyway, so we have a lot of A napkins if your name is a and a lot of okay so now this piece right here is really really um really gorgeous it's french it's renaissance revival um it, the carving is exquisite um it is five thousand dollars this piece right here look at this dragon i have to these uh they have to be uh put in the doors, but look at that. I mean, you don't, you know, there's, there's, there's fruit, it's bounty, it's French, it's like from the mid 1800s. Um, there are these Chinese wood pieces for $250 each. Uh, then I've got these two Chinese pictures, two Chinese paintings. This one is 250 and this goes with it. It's also 250. There's a large concrete, I think it's concrete, not stone. Yes, it's concrete. Um, horse picture and this, it has a damage, but um, it's $250. We've got this Chinese bronze and it is 40. We've got a little stand for 25, another bronze for 130. Uh, this sensor is Qing Dynasty. It's twelve hundred. We've got a lot of glasses here. Uh, some of the glasses are ten dollars. Some of the glasses are five dollars. Um, there is a beautiful bowl, horse bowl, for sixty. Waterford crystal ashtray for twenty. Murano glass vase for twenty horse for 50. Yes? Hold on one second, you guys, because there seems to be an issue. Hi, I'm in, if you can, for appointments. yeah, um, if they can just wait there, that would be great, because I'm in the middle of doing this video, so I'll tell Susan, I'll go find them. Yeah. yeah.
Hold on one second, you guys. This is just, I'm sorry to make you do my errands with me, but that's what's gonna have to happen. Hey, Susan or Tracy, yeah. can you go pick up some people that are outside? Um, I'm with somebody right now, though. I know, can you just go get the new one and bring them up to here? Okay, thank you. Oh, uh, where are you? No, no, I'll, I'll go in there and do the clothes and if you can just go get them. So each of these paintings are 2,500. I'm sorry, I just, um, I'm sorry. Okay, and so then in here we've got this rug. Hi, how are you? Hi, nice to see you guys. Um, so we've got these, this rug for $300. We've got this dresser for 250. Uh, Susan will be right back if you guys can wait. She's okay. just gonna pick up the other people. Um, we just have to stay together. It's but just the, the way. The, where the, the holding the table? Uh, there is no holding table, unfortunately. So if we... um, you can take it out to the front and put it on the table as you first enter. Okay. This is $250 for this safe. This painting right here is $600. This mirror is $1,300. This lounge, like the Le Corbusier lounge, is $1,200. Uh, these gold Chanel shoes, which I think the client who I'm here with would like, these gold Chanel shoes are $800 or $80, $185. The jewelry, it's $25 a piece. The dresser is $500. The glass lamp is $50. Oh dear, can you ask your husband to come back? He's not, oh my gosh, okay. This table, it's a desk, it's $700. This side table is $1,800. It's Italian Renaissance, it's authentic, not revival. So this is from like the 1600s. I believe. Um, this is a mirrored nightstand for 250. It's 34 by 34 by 14. That, so we have a lot of clothes, but you'll have to come in and see them. The headboard, which mounts to the wall, is 500. And the, there's a lot of shoes. They're all size eight ladies. There is a pair of these bedside tables, which are $150 each. This mirror, Italian Renaissance Revival for 500. This giant wardrobe is 1200. It's got really great carvings on it. Which one? Musicians. Oh, right there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's $600. Oh, I need to find that gentleman because he, uh, he has disappeared. Okay, so in here, we'll, we'll move into this room. So again, we've got this great Renaissance piece for uh, $1,800. It is the Madonna and Child. It's 47.75 by 36.5, and the artist is unknown. We have this great black forest carving of a... A uh, person who is um, doing, you know, grape harvesting, and he is 400. These frames are 85 or 80. This painting of the Madonna and Child um, is $2,500. Yeah. <laughs> Very beautiful. I'm, do you know, I'm doing a video, but if you could stick with your wife, because we are not yeah, everything yeah. is for sale, and it's very confusing right now yeah, today yeah. because the owner is here and. Really? Her stuff is here and uh, <laughs> that we're not supposed to see and stuff. So, yeah, if you don't mind, it would be so awesome. Thank you. So $5,000 on this piece right here. Sorry, it's like you get to see the whole inner workings of the madness of this sale, which I want to apologize about before you even get here. Um, I've got two of these blue velvet wingback chairs. They're $100 a piece. We have... Really fine Matuk bedding, California King, for $50. Queen Sheets, $25. Charisma Queen, $25. Um, a lot of really charming pillowcases, you know. 
This Stark rug is 23 feet by 18. It is $8,000. It was purchased for or from the Sultan of Brunei. He had it commissioned because it was going to be um, because it was going to be uh, in his hotel in Beverly Hills, but then he, he changed his decor idea, so it ended up here. But it's a Stark carpet, which is really fine. This console is 800. These sofas are hardwood frames. They're 600 each. These chairs, there's um, some condition issues on them. They are 150 each. They're very cute. Um, and then we've got this fireplace tools for 150. This Majolica container for 125. The umbrellas are five each and the, the flag is 25. This chair right here is 200. And it has a model match to it, but the model match is, has some really serious condition issues, and so it's 50. Um, this piece right here is 50. Again, we've got some, we've got a, another one of those pieces for 800. We've got the Frederick Remington Bucking Bronco for 400. We've got this lamp for 40. We've got two Savarinola chairs, Renaissance Revival, with condition issues. They are 200 apiece, um, but they're great. But they do, you know, you, again, you'll have to work them. Uh, these, this lamp is 150 with the soldier. There are two of them. And those slatted pieces of wood are 30 each. This cabinet is $1,800. Actually, I'm sorry, it's $2,000. It's like a bar cabinet. It's got all of the great carvings. We've got all of these Chinese vase holders, really beautiful ones from the estate of an earlier estate that uh, happened when one of the principals here passed away. So we have these Baccarat horses. They range from 50 to 150 for the big one. We have this carved wood plant stand with a marble top for 275. And then 300 for the pair for these wooden sconces beautiful, heavy, serious. Um, this is, a, this is again, Isabel of Spain, another engraving. This one is 200 because it doesn't have the same condition issues as the other. Um, yeah, so I think, oh, um, so I think we did the clothes. I'll take you downstairs. We have this table right here for 600 and the towels are just, you know, towel prices. Um, and we have chairs. These are all, that chair is 175, that chair is 75, 75, the table's 50, lamp 40. This French marquetry cabinet is 800. These books are for sale here. The aquarium journals are $3 a piece. Uh, we've got, uh, Two of these, they're 400 each. We've got the Gunsel by Harry Jackson for 15,000. We've got these two chairs for 700 a piece. Uh, this marble topped console for 600. And then this Murano glass shark for 375. It is by Zanetti. Again, more of these. We have more clothes. We have this long, 10 foot cabinet here for 1800. We have Iroquois Guide by Harry Jackson for 20,000. This sweet painting of a Marin Full for $150 by Kelly. Two glass sconces for 80. We have Harry Jackson the Frontiersman for 20,000. Here, okay. Here is the second. This is a beautiful painting right here for 2,500. It's 17th century Italian. It is St. Michael the Archangel. Beautiful. Okay, we have this rug, 90 by 113. We have a bedside table for 150. A picture frame, I mean a picture frame, oh my gosh, a bed frame, queen size for 350. This is $150, this flower arrangement. And it's by somebody significant. 
uh, you can see under there who it is because I looked it up and I just can't remember off the top of my head. Got bedding. We still aren't completely ready at this sale, 100. Um, the dresser, a lot of handbags that we need to sort of go through. There's a Tory Burke in there, Tory Burch, sorry. And then we've got some more pieces here, fun, you know, girl stuff or boy stuff. I don't know. Um, and then we will go out here. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? sweet. Yeah. Okay, and then we've got two mirrors here for $200, $250 each, um, which I don't think I showed you before. Okay, and then... I'm sorry, you guys. I feel like I've been super boring. I apologize for this. Normally, I try to make it a whole lot more fun, but I think I'm a little bit stressed out because there's just so many um, elements at this sale that are confusing to me because the owner still hasn't separated her stuff from the stuff that we're selling, so it creates a lot of chaos here for us. Um, oh, actually, you know what? I think we might be done. <laughs> I think we might be done. Um, let's see here. Thank you guys so much for watching this. And um, please text me or DM me if there's anything that you want that I showed you. Otherwise, we'll see you tomorrow, hopefully. Bye.